Kevin Rudd has tried to shake off Labor's carbon tax headache by fast-tracking Julia Gillard's plan to move to an emissions trading scheme. Business groups have welcomed the move, but Tony Abbott says it's a con job on Australian families. The non-campaign campaign hit cans. It was Rudd mania in far north Queensland. Hey, how are you? Lovely to see you. The polls show personally he's cleaning up. But his plan to scrap the carbon tax in favour of an emissions trading scheme could take an even bigger bite out of the coalition's narrow lead. Mr Abbott has said that um, he thinks climate change is crap. Another Kevin con job. Uh, he's changed its name, but he hasn't abolished the tax. Uh, you will still pay and it will still hurt. The government says not as much as before, with a reduction in power bills and families will get to keep the household assistance package. But it doesn't come free. There is a substantial impact on the budget of doing this, of course there is, and it is several billion dollars. And that's because of the shortfall. Under the carbon tax, the government reaped over $24 a tonne. Under a floating or market price, it drops substantially. This is just classic Kevin Rudd. Change the name to change the conversation. The move to an emissions trading scheme isn't new, but the timetable is. Julia Gillard had planned to move to a market price by 2015. That will now be brought forward to July next year. Business groups back the move, and it's no surprise the Greens don't. Kevin Rudd is a fake on the climate. That will be up to voters to decide. The coalition launching two new ads today. Kevin Rudd is all talk. This election campaign is going to be a marathon. Yeah. Smile. Smile. Mia Greaves, 17.